everybody welcome back i've had in mind a matte look for a while i've always been glowy i've always been doing looks with highlight on my cheekbones but today i wanted yesterday i tried like a matte look so i decided to film it so if you want to know how to get this look then keep on watching so i'm just going to start by prepping my eye with the nyx jumbo eye pencil and milk and it looks a bit too white but it's all gonna come together so set that with the tr any translucent powder so I'm going to go in with what I'm going to use to bronze slash contour there are blushes you can use as eyeshadow there are bronzers you can use as eyeshadow or eyeshadows that can be used as bronzers 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 um, yeah it's all just about getting to know and adventuring if I can say natural bronzer from Rimmel in sunlight see the difference yeah and i'm going to go in with this other bronzer i have from mac i've used it before it's golden just darken it up a little bit okay so i'm going to grab my nudes palette um, i'm just going to grab a bit of a slightly darker brown not too dark this one right here just a little bit Focus that dark brown. If you have hooded lids like me, focus that dark brown on the outer part. And you can slide it a bit, but not too much. Okay, so now that we have both of them done, I'm just going to add a bit more of the NYX Jumbo Pencil in the middle here. Just brighten it up on top of that. This one right here. I'm going to trace out my wing. I'm going to go in with this Duo Stroke Dual Ended Precision Liquid Liner from Absolute New York. Got this one at Gem Beauty. And I'm going to fill them in with my NYC Liquid Liner. I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Fit Me matte and poreless foundation i have the dewy and smooth foundation but this one's the matte version i've heard it's not too different from the other one but i'm gonna stay true to the matte and i got the same one 230 natural buff i love how it feels um i've never really tried a matte uh, besides the cap on D1, but like a drugstore mat because I always thought I was gonna dry out my face But I'm loving this one. Like I love the coverage of it. I'm going to conceal and slash highlight I'm going to use the new born this way. It's the new Too Faced concealer blends out like a dream we're gonna bake 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 all right so I did my brows I put on some lashes the kiss lashes in 11 I'm just going to go in again with the Rimmel bronzer and sunlight and just mix it in with a bit of the golden for Mac For blush, I'm going to use CoverGirl's Classic Pink. I think it's so pretty. Grab a big brush and just blend it all together. I'm going to use this mascara, Smoky Extravagant from Makeup Forever. I don't know if it's waterproof. It doesn't say. For my waterline, I'm just going to go in with the eyeliner in Nude. Just give it a more brightened look. I'm going to go in with what I've been already using is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Powder. You don't necessarily need to use sprays to set your face. There are also powders. For my lips, I'm using NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in London. So yeah, this is it. Uh, this is my matte look. It feels kind of weird not having highlight on my cheekbone, but hey, this works too. It's 
okay I kind of prefer with highlight but I love I'm loving how it feels matte it doesn't it's not itching me it's not bothering me anyway that is it uh, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next video bye